I'm Chef Edwin. So basically, I run a home bakery. We make desserts and we sell it to friends, family, and whoever else who loves good desserts. So just making it from home and giving it the best to the market, and hopefully people can enjoy it. I just think that Malaysia deserves a little bit more of better artisanal desserts. The dream is actually to own a patisserie. I started from home with not much of a budget, we just an oven and a mixer, so we just did that. We need to make sure that when we service the customer, we need to think how they feel when they are actually going to celebrate their celebrations. So if it's a birthday, how can we help to bring an extra touch, bring an extra twist to the birthday than just a normal birthday cake, you know. So that's the principle that we stand by and every smile that we put into every customer, it's our achievement. There was a lot of ups and downs. There is still ups and downs. We also supply to the cafes and all, so there was also a drop in that. After that, there was an increase in that because the pandemic was getting better. But after that, there was another CMCO. It's just pure disruption. This year has been a roller coaster year. We actually worked with chefs on the wheels. We actually provided desserts. They were actually providing to the frontliners. So we actually give our desserts alongside with their meals to the frontliners. So not only just purely the frontliners, we even serve the ones that were doing the PPE because we are a food operator. We want to provide food to the needy or the one that you know will actually enjoy it when it's needed. So I hope that sweet little cupcake actually did provide some sweetness to these hardworking frontliners. <laughs> Even though with the pandemic happening, we want to improve quality. So we want to use good equipment. And the dream is always to open a patisserie. So whether it's the pandemic or it's not, it is a dream and we should be working for it. That is why I think of this being portable. So that is one reason. Yes. Yes. yes, that is one reason to make it portable, one thing. Second thing, this is actually the chill pie, even when we go to the exhibition. Something hippie, so people will actually take picture with it. Catchy, yeah, sounds mm. catchy. Basically, a functional pastry kitchen with proper sanitization, proper equipment. Hopefully, we can serve good desserts, artisanal desserts to the market. And at least during the pandemic, they can still enjoy some sweetness mm -hmm. to get them still feel what's life. <laughs> yeah. My name is Sadato Akuma. I'm working as an admin for Elevate and actually I'm taking care of admin and HR side for Elevate and a bit of sales. How do I feel about the CMCO and this pandemic situation is of course I'm a little bit affected by the whole situation. For example, salary cutting from my previous employers but I believe that this whole situation actually opened another new opportunities for me to work with Elevate. The joy of Elevate itself is to cater to the market. So as much as we can cater sweet treats to the market, we hope even during the pandemic, people could still enjoy and have their life some way or another with our sweet treats. So it's, it's our pride and joy to make artisanal products to the market and we hope the market, even with such a downtime, they could actually enjoy simple sweet treats. Yep.